What's up guys? Today I got a super quick tip for you that'll save yourself a little bit of time, a little bit of trouble, and possibly keep you from breaking something. This has to do with the fan blower motor on pretty much anything that's got a blower motor in it. So you guys stick around because this one, pretty neat. All right, like I explained in the intro, we're working on a 2000 Ford F-250. Uh, it's the same way with Kenworth, Peterbilt, Freightliner, pretty much anything that's got a blower motor on it that has the plastic wheel attached to the shaft. So let me turn this around here and I'll show you a little trick. All right, so you can see we got the blower motor out. Of course it was there. And on top of the shaft, it's got this little metal clip that's got the little springs that lock into a groove here simple enough just take something like this matco pry bar and work it around it to pop your clip off the second thing most people want to pry from the back side and you'll break that plastic especially on one that's about 20 year old like this one um i've seen a lot of guys break them on peterbilt's and kenworth and stuff and those little wheels are kind of expensive they're about 30 to 40 bucks a piece so the best thing to do is take you some penetrating oil, such as this. Just give it a little shot right there around that and let it set for a few seconds. Don't rush it. It's gonna be hard to do one-handed, but we're gonna try. So you can take and just tap on the shaft you'll see the plastic wheel just works its way up then you can just pull it off I may have to take a punch and put on the shaft and just tap it so let me do that I will have to have two hands so I have to cut the camera off so hang tight all right so what I did here is I just put the punch down on the metal shaft and tapped it and it slid right out so when you go back on with these, remember they're a D shape. You can see it's got the flat side there at the bottom. So the new motor will have the D shaped shaft. You just slide that on there, push it down all the way and then put your clip back on the top after you get it together. But hopefully that'll keep you guys from breaking some of these and maybe that's a tip some of y'all didn't know. So there you go, freebie tip. So, like always, guys, thanks for watching the video. If you like this video, hit that thumbs up. Click that subscribe button right down there in the corner. You guys have a great week, and we will catch y'all next time. See ya.